Hey y'all, Chatel Red, the grown ass teenager in the building. And um I'm doing a reaction on well it's no title, but I'm gonna make my own title. Y'all gonna see this BBL to that's the title. Y'all gonna see this fucking BBL, period. <laughs> White lady said, I'm out of here. <laughs> she said, uh uh. Sis said, I paid way too much money to not show this body off. Oh, no, bag. I got holding in my hand. I don't have no other bag. No bag. She said, no bag. Did she got a mask on? She ain't even let her um her she ain't even let her um scars heal up first. Let your scars heal up or tattoo them bitches or something. If you gonna walk outside naked, I don't know if this was a um a stunt, but that shit is crazy. She got a nice BBL though. Her shit is proportioned very nicely. It fits her body. If she would have had on clothes or waited till her scars healed up. I would have thought that was a natural body. Looks very, very nice. Yes. Shout out to Shorty Doctor. Because they did their damn thing on her, hunty. That's what I like to see. If you're going to do it, do it right. Because y'all hoes be looking very, very crazy. Let me give you an example. On how these hoes be looking. Hold on, let me find it. So, here we go. The first one. Females talking about my BBL. That is crazy because that's how a lot of y'all chicks be looking. Y'all be very disproportioned, like. Because y'all be going to DR and all that shit. Y'all need to stay in the United States where they have regulations. Where they have things regulating them and they can't get too crazy. Because that with the skinny legs and the big old hips. Let your shit be proportioned. That's just ridiculous. Let me show y'all another one. <laughs> Here we go. Now she almost broke her ankle. Not almost, not I almost broke my ankle. Ah, that's the whole title. I'm dead. Uh-uh, they play too much. <laughs> All right, last one. Nah. That's crazy. Sis really look like a bug too. Like uh ant life. <laughs> Yo, sis really look like ant life. Yo, if you gonna go get your body done, at least make it look natural or halfway natural. Cause y'all be out here just straight looking crazy. Motherfuckers be like, just give me the biggest, biggest body that you can make. Get all the fat and the silicone or whatever because when they shape like that, that ain't no regular BBL. Because if they skinny, where's they getting the fat from to put in your body? Where they getting the fat from? You don't have no fat. So they getting um whatever they get, silicone and whatever else they be shooting in y'all bunches. I just feel for the women that work out and do they shit the right way. And now you don't get the props that you deserve because niggas are still gonna be looking at you like, did she make that body or did she build that body? You know? 
So natural body women don't get no more props. Like before people used to be like, okay, okay, I see you sis. Now motherfuckers be looking at you sus like, hmm, because some of these doctors be doing a good job. So all the natural women who do they shit the natural way, props to y'all, I see y'all. Y'all matter, natural bodies matter, period. We matter, I should say. You know, if you was born, you never had a waist before, you never had hips or whatever, you know, you just a, a SpongeBob SquarePants person. You know, some people just built weird. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Don't make me act crazy on here. But um, disclaimer for them, if you never had that and you want that, I get it, kind of. Yeah, I kind of get it because, you know, it's not like working out is going to give you hips or working out is going to make your waist small because that's the way you're shaped. But on the other side, also, you got to say you need to be thankful for what you for what you got. You get what you get and you don't get upset. Like how you think God's going to feel about you changing his body like he made you that way. He is a perfectionist. So he feel he made you the way you're supposed to be made. So now, how he gonna feel? Like, you need to think about that. Yeah, he, he you're telling God that he's not a perfectionist, that he messed you up. I don't have a problem with anybody getting surgeries. I just have more respect for the people that get their bodies natural because it takes a lot. So I respect them because it takes dedication, discipline, sacrifice, um, a bunch of other shit that I can't think of right now. <laughs> but it takes a lot of that. Like you got to watch what you eat. You, you got to do a whole lifestyle change. And then once y'all get them BBLs, y'all got to maintain it. You already got the cheat code. You got the cheat code already. The body is done. Cool. All you got to do is maintain it. But y'all don't even be doing that. Some of y'all. Some of y'all don't even be doing that. Y'all don't wear the little, what they call them shits, uh, waist trainers or, no. They call it whatever they call it when you get the BBL. It's the whole thing. It, 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 it holds your butt, your stomach, everything together. I can't think of the name of it. Y'all don't even be doing that. Y'all don't go get the massages. Y'all supposed to go get the massages that do whatever they supposed to do. <laughs> Massage all the fluids out and all of that. And then y'all just eat whatever. Y'all don't do no lifestyle change. So then y'all just gain the weight back, gain the fat back. And then what y'all do, go get another surgery. That is, do y'all know how dangerous that is? Like y'all are really really risking your lives especially y'all that go out the country if you ain't going to like Colombia or some shit because Colombia has a very good um um medical system over there especially for like cosmetology like uh doing bodies and all that for everything teeth all that shit people be going to Colombia if you ain't going to Colombia if you going to DR or some shit please don't just stop just stop go to the gym because you can look fit and all of that and your body do not be fit on the inside so your body looking all like you in shape and then like you healthy with a healthy lifestyle but then the inside of your body is all fucked up you got high blood pressure high cholesterol arteries is clogged all kind of shit going on because you're not working out exercise your heart so that's it. I ain't going to drag this on and on because I could, but I won't. <laughs> and that's all I got to say on that.